Quick intro, let's get to it and go down the lanes at Walmart because I know you're ready. If you like what you see, please subscribe, hit like, and get ready, folks, because Walmart is coming at you. You drive a car into Walmart, they said, shoot. <laughs> well, come on, man. You freaking look like that, dude. You're driving a car right into Walmart. What else should we expect? What an opening scene into Walmart. Uh, Down doesn't have much, but the world's biggest Walmart. What could go wrong here? That's a pretty massive one, I must say. Like, you know, get the groceries downstairs, your other shop and upstairs. More money, more problems. And Walmart, more square footage, more problems. A Walmart the size of Ikea, not good. This motherfucker got people tripping. <laughs> Try again, Walmart. You think that's going to stop someone from stealing this? Put it in their pocket. Think again, Walmart. Dude rode a four-wheeler in Walmart. <laughs> no way. Dude, who? What? The horse is one thing, and now you're ripping a wheeler? I don't know, honestly. I mean, you know, you could be a normal person. Get on the little rascal. So this kid is behind me and he keeps following me, hollering, hey mom, <laughs> I don't know who this kid is. <laughs> he keeps getting closer. Get out of here. I don't have any kids. Mom, mom, I need a toy. Mom, mom, V-Bucks, mom, mom, Robux. Can you open this up for me please? Yeah, of course. Get out of here, no way. Alright, make sure you can. Okay, Seriously thanks. Seriously, scan. Okay, thanks. <laughs> I was gonna say, if this is not a joke, uh, you're locking up the old juicy fruit. It's gotta take more time to pay someone than your profit margin to lock those dang juicy fruit up is it me or is this just some weird ass people in walmart dude you might be the weird one man sometimes that's how you notice there's weird people in walmart it's because you're the weird one <laughs> this has got to be one of my favorites of all time dude the old freaking little rascal turned into the lawn chair doesn't get much better than that Why did you do that? Oh, because there are like a lot of good things in this part when I needed it. <laughs> People are what? You know, come on, come on, that's the bad, come on. What's that? Oh, oh what is that? Oh, dude. What is that? <laughs> <laughs> what is that? <laughs> Oh, dude. The lights go off. It's not open 24-7 anymore. Who knows what's going on when the store is empty? How many rats are coming out to play? Y'all, this is not a trend. Stop. Going down the stuffed animals, man. Ripping these things apart. Ripping the aisles apart. No, that's just not right. Walmart said they're short-staffed. This guy, excuse me. Bro logged out. <laughs> All right, boys. We are now out. 
<laughs> Dude, he was gone. I just love right when it happened. That lady was waiting. So Walmart messed up our order. We ordered like, what did we order? Frozen pizza for dinner and apples. So like $20 worth of stuff for delivery. And we got all of this. This person's like having a party. Look at chips, taco shells. Cinnamon Toast Crunch in a bag? Pasta up in here. Look at all this stuff. I didn't know Cinnamon Toast Crunch came Check in a bag. Out. These are expensive. So here's the question. Do we return it all? What do we do? You know, I don't know. Someone else was waiting for that. Yeah. <laughs> the secret shopper in Walmart. <laughs> oh, bastards. Oh, dude. This is what I've been talking about. Working at OGP at Walmart. If y'all know, y'all know. Why do these people want 12 cases of water in an oversized? 12 of these. 12 of them. <laughs> but at least it ain't the, the big fat 40 pack. Anyways, find me a new job, y'all. Why would I go inside and take two or three carts low when I can just do Walmart pickup and you bring it out to me? Things I hate while working at Walmart. Hey, excuse me, do you know where the bathroom is? Hey, excuse me, do you work here? <laughs> excuse me, can you tell me where the nose rings at? <laughs> hey, do you know where the bell peppers are? All right, it can't be that bad. Hey, excuse me, can you tell me where I can find the gift card at? All right, all right, I get it. You know what, us customers, you know what, we can be helpless at times. Let me see. Creeper was following us from Walmart until I followed them back. Yeah. Get out, dude. Come on, we need somebody to help us. This is crazy. Dude, that is sketch. That is so sketch. Get out of there. Get the heck out of there. I don't care if it's an old lady. Dude, I don't know, man. There's sketchy, and then there's this trench coat sketchy. Excuse me. You're rocking a trench coat, you know, face covered, everything. Yeah, you got getting the hell out of there. The one time I come to Walmart. Oh, that's crazy. I thought they were playing. <laughs> Excuse me, can you <laughs> Can't be comparing Walmart to Target, dude. I love Walmart. That, uh, whew, we've missed those, haven't we? We've all missed the Walmart meltdowns like this. This is a friendly reminder to check your meat before you buy it because Walmart does it. Dude. I found this moldy ass, nasty ass meat on the shelf. In late July, and it expired in May. <laughs> May expiration? Look, I'm all for it. You got mold, you can eat around it. I don't think you're working or eating around that mold. That's the whole piece. You might be able to scrape it off, but yeah. Walmart packaging, be lack. This is Amazon packaging, too. You can't, like, all these store shippers are unbelievable wasteful. Look at that. <laughs> for an umbrella <laughs> just out of some of the stupid stuff i've ordered it's like wait what all that for this no. shit and one more park one i'm so sorry <laughs> shit, on the, cops shit on, on the car i'm gonna clean it up i got it call the cops on him why no way are you dropping dookies in the parking lot when the bathroom is a football field away i literally cannot make this up so I'm in Walmart and I was looking at vision poles. So I practiced, casted a pole. So here's the pole that I practiced, casted. I flung it just this way. And 
<laughs> Look what's stuck. Stuck. Up there. It blew out and landed. Just like a squeak. <laughs> With a birthday cake or verse for my daughter versus the one I got. I love these. Oh my god, okay. This is what I wanted, okay? This is the pastels. And this is what I got. You missed the most important part. The reason the gal wanted it is because it had a unicorn. All right? Maybe it's a waffle cone, an edible unicorn horn on the cake. You can't just put a picture on it. Probably charge the same price, too. Come on. Walmart failed. Never seems to fail, dude. It's always a TV in a little car. I'm trying to watch them fit this gigantic TV in this car, and I don't think it's going to happen. Also, you should have just had that ordered and brought to your door. I don't know why you thought Walmart pickup was the best idea. Yeah, dude. They'll deliver it right to your door, man. Why do people do that? They get these big-ass TVs, and then they're like, oh, wait. I have a very small SUV. <laughs> now what you could have did, dude, the whole Walmart delivery lady makes a great valid point here. I'm not allowed. I'll send the dollies down. Okay, I'll tell you what. Come and stand out here and listen to what's going on. It happens. I got to put dollies down. We got water. Don't put your video. Don't talk to me that way. Looks like an oldie Walmart. I don't care who you are care who you are when you go to walmart for a haircut <laughs> oh what the f this? <laughs> dude i don't really see an it's issue man already. Turn what in the hell oh my gosh it's so much worse from the other side I mean, <laughs> the other side show me I really don't think it's that bad, man. You never grew up going back to the JC Penney's haircut in the back of that store. At least there's no patch, man. Flashback to the time I went to Walmart and saw this. Boy, he got the snow, <laughs> no. Asking Walmart employees the dumbest questions. Wait till the last guy. Sorry, are you guys open? I'm sorry? Are you guys open? Am I open? What do you ask again? If you guys are open. Who? You. The store? Yeah. Uh, I believe so. Are you sure? Good. Well, like, you can buy stuff? Until 11 o'clock. But, like, you're open right now. Uh-huh. Are you guys open today? <laughs> Do what? Are you guys open? We're open right now. Like the store? Yeah, it's open. We're open, you can be in here. The doors will be locked. So you guys are open then? <laughs> Excuse me, sir. Yeah. Uh, are you guys open today? Yeah. Are you sure? The store? Yeah. Yeah. Why? Wow, what's going on? You work at Walmart, right? Yes. I'm, I'm a custodian. Oh, I thought you were the manager. No, you need. do you need a manager? I got 30 more minutes to get out hey, of here. Hey, 30 more minutes. Oh, <laughs> I got to give it to you, dude. That's, man, it's all right. Excuse me. Could you please record me for just a second? Oh my god. Way to freaking kill it, all right? Way to show these young tic tackers out here how it's really done, how to make a trend work. Walmart bag only has one hole to carry. <laughs> what are the chances, huh? Embarrassing each other in Walmart. Did you grab your tampons? Because <laughs> you're bleeding a whole lot. <laughs> Excuse me, where is the tampon now? My, my fiance's bleeding. Welcome to the couch for at least a month if I'm going into Walmart saying that. Well, folks, apparently walking around Walmart with an Alka-Seltzer <laughs> in your mouth screaming, the vaccine isn't working, is not a good idea. <laughs> Here they come. The funniest part about this, at one point in time, this was an unpostable video. How does someone else drive a car? I thought, dude, what? Someone rips a full car into Wally World. <clears throat> And you're blowing zeros on that toxicity report? Mind blown in the first place. Like, how do you get around the little pillars in the front? POV, you decide to shop at Walmart. <laughs> dude, what? A machete-wielding cigarette-smoking dude? How does that work? A 
Dude, I thought I was the last guy that started collecting machetes, man. I love machetes. There's something about it. But uh, bringing one into Walmart, no thank you. I'm leaving that thing at home. Getting your fishing license at Walmart. Oh, it's official. I am now licensed. <laughs> but it's easy. When you ask an employee where something is. <laughs> Well, not my department. I, I'm not working in automotive today. Well, you're standing here. You're in automotive right now. Can't you just tell me where uh, the filters are at? People throw anything on to go to Walmart. They do. <laughs> TVs, dude. You know what? Go in. Get a roll of duct tape. I bet that'll help this TV stay in the back a little bit longer. <laughs> you know what? Walmart, it's got a mind of its own. It's coming at you. <laughs> Dude, I couldn't even get a piece of paper underneath that jump, man. Sometimes at Walmart on Saturdays, the line does this type of thing. What? So I'm standing over here in produce just waiting to check out with my groceries. I'm thankful. I'll tell you guys where I live, man, my Walmart is a ripper. Like there's always three, four cash registers open. Self checkouts never down. They're always stocked with stuff. Like I gotta get, dude, my Walmart is a good one. When a kid looks at me for help and for help after their parents smacked them for acting a fool in the store. But the kid deserved it. <laughs> kid deserved a smack, dude. Shoot, I thought we lived in the tw 20th century here. 3, 16, 24, people of Walmart in Rome, be live. Someone left the damn diaper in the shopping cart. That's just disgusting. Oh, thank you. Oh, my goodness. How do you just leave it in the shopping cart? <laughs> oh, someone left a damn diaper in the shopping cart, dude. Just... The way you said it had me rolling, dude. And then you're gonna go pick it up barehanded, even, man. Like. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is unbelievable. No! <laughs> no! What the? What the? Stop it! <laughs> oh man. What in the Walmart? What? Yeah. What? I'm not, you know what? This is a good thing, honestly. Like if your Walmart is that good that you're willing to go there pre-wedding, post-wedding, get a couple supplies. You know what? That's a good Walmart. So I'm walking through Walmart and I always try to look for a cake that kind of represents how I'm feeling about life and stuff. And <laughs> I think I found it. Is that how you're feeling for 58 bucks? That's how you're feeling? Jeez, dude. Hey, um, do you like enchiladas? <laughs> Some kid came in and that was their prank. This is one. Go do that, dude. Go hang out in the electronics. Get photos, man. Do little voice recordings like this. Harmless. But all right. All right. That does it, you guys. That does it for the Walmart. The introduction back to the gold and the glory of Walmart. And what we're about to see in the, the upcoming future episodes. So, you know what? Please share this up. Get it recommended to others. Let people know we're back at it. We are in the full swing of things. And there's going to be a lot more goodness, greatness, goldness to come your way. But for now, that does it. I hope you guys enjoy it and hope you keep coming back for more. Because you never know what's going to be next. You're on the D channel. My pussy <laughs> matters. Black Lives Matter. My pussy matters. <laughs> Dude, get out of here. Oh, dude, I miss the meltdowns. This is why we enjoy the videos is because the whole context comes out. We can put a picture to that, put a little meme writing on top. It ain't the same as uh, watching the meltdown go down. Bro, if you gonna kill me, kill me right now, bro. I'm wearing a, a hat, all yellow, and a black, some black Crocs. I'm looking like a banana right now. 
This one big old black ass, but why? Huh? Huh? What do you mean? Why are you looking at me like that? What are you talking about? What the f you mean? Hey, bro, if you gonna kill me, come kill me right now, bro. Come kill me right now. I got uh all yellow. I don't know, man. A red and black. somewhere else. A red. I don't know. This is one of them, dude. Like you know, ah, you know, ah, some pranks, dude. Don't do them, man.